Hi everyone, my name is Seng Kim Hua. Uh, currently, I am the political and press officer at the German Embassy here in Phnom Penh. I would like to talk to you a bit about my personal experience with the Conrad Adenauer Stiftung Scholarship. So um, some of my friends, colleagues and professors told me that Conrad Adenauer Stiftung is a political foundation. As a political science student, uh, it is natural for me to be interested uh, about the organization. I'm going to talk to you more about also how I uh, come to apply for the scholarship at Conrad Adenauer Stiftung. And hello everyone, my name is Chan Chung Vajini and currently I am studying a master's degree in international economics and public policy in Germany at the University of Trier. Hi, my name is Bi San Su. I am doing a master's degree in Germany at the moment in global communication at the University of Erfurt. Currently, I am a master's student of international media study at Bonn Rheinzeit University of Applied Science and DW Academy in Bonn. I first heard about CARS during my undergraduate study in media management at the Royal University of Phnom Penh. Since then, I started to learn more about CARS and its programs, its events. I learned that they offer scholarship opportunity for students to study in Germany, especially in the subject of political science for someone like me. There are many scholarships that you can apply if you want to study in Europe. But what I like the most about CAS scholarships is that CAS has the light gas um, network in Germany. CAS scholarships holders are given a countless opportunity to burden their knowledge as well as to, uh, to build network in Germany. I was encouraged by my German and French professors in Cambodia to pursue a higher degree in Germany Plus, I always dream of pursuing higher education in Europe and I also want to learn a third language. One of class value is to help youth to develop themselves and to um, be able to become a pillar of the society. Also, class vision is a lot about trying to bring the better for Cambodia and that makes us a team. Of course, there are some challenges when I had just arrived in terms of settling in, adjusting to the education system, time zone, culture, and learning a new language. When I first arrived here, I did not know how to take the public bus. And I often find myself missing the bus because I wait at the wrong bus stop. It is difficult because no one will tell you where the answer is. So as a student yourself, you have to do a lot of research, reading, and always be critical with what's happening around you. I learned new culture, new way of life, and I have met interesting people. I have traveled to beautiful places in Germany, historical sites that shaped Germany as we know today. The library is so big, and as you can see, there are a lot of books offered in different languages, and you can just Sit there peacefully, do your research, finish your coursework, and also finish your assignment. The library there just give me the best condition to study. In my class, um, we have 29 students from 27 countries from Africa, America, Asia, and Europe. So um, we always share and respect perspective from each other and experiences. It's not only the academic support that I receive from Conrad Adina Stiftung. I also uh, receive guidance and advice from them after becoming an alumni. Uh, I met them from time to time to talk to each other just to discuss about my career. And their advice and also guidance is part of the factor that helped me to get my job at the German Embassy. A key for a successful application is to know your aspirations and make sure that you are able to communicate it in the written application. Be prepared. Set the goal of what university, big subject you want to study. Then you will find quick way to Germany. Have some time to do research about the country, about the university, and about the opportunity that offer in Cambodia to study in Germany. Just go for it. Be prepared and just go for it. 
and of course uh, follow Cast Cambodia website for um, the scholarships.